Hey, what's up everyone? Professor Danny and Alex. Today, in this tutorial, we're going to look at the close guard position and also attacking the armbar when the opponent tries to defend. So check it out. Alright, so I'm going to set up the armbar position from the close guard. So here I'm having a sleeve grip going at the elbow, controlling his arm. Now going up on top to his shoulder here to break his posture. Now once I start to connect my armbar technique, a lot of times this can go perfectly. But other times at the last second, the opponent might try to grab his arm as such and block. Notice how the arm I was trying to catch is being held by the opposite side. So now you're going to end up in this position here. So a nice little trick to break his grip is use the first hand, the one that's free, and go latch onto his wrist. The moment you have this connection, you'll remove the second one, go on top of your own hand, and look, because of the power of my leg position and my hips, you can still finalize the armbar position. So once again, connect the armbar from here as I'm working this connection here, one, two, and now I attack the arm, but I lose the extension of his arm. So it's very important. The first hand is going to go control his wrist so it doesn't hide it. I'll remove the first hand here, go on top of my first hand, and now from here, extend and finalize. Now another trick we can do is once we attack the armbar position, as we start to extend our arms here, and he blocks, now we have a stronger opponent where we can't tug the arm out of there. So we're going to switch the grip. Look, notice how the first arm is going inside, grabbing both of his arms and now holding onto your lap. Now this free hand is going to go underhooking his leg. So if I have space, I'll underhook on the knee. If the knee is tight, I'll just grab on the outside of his pants. Okay? So once we're here now, we're going to extend our right leg, the one that's over top. And as he falls, let's turn towards the camera. As he falls here now, you're going to end up in this position right here. What I'm going to do is cross my ankle. So the bottom leg is going to go on top of the first leg. And look, we're just going to undo the latch. So basically when he's holding on like this, tug on the elbow. Now this hand goes to the wrist, second one to the wrist. And here we have the armbar. So once again, we're attacking the armbar. We'll do it on the opposite side. From here, as I start to turn and I attack, he defends. So notice how the first hand is going to go inside, trap his arms, hold on to your lap. Now this free hand is going to go under hooking here. Now I'm going to tug, push him to the mat. Let's turn a little bit. Now from here, what's going to happen is you're going to end up in this control here. I'm going to bring my leg over top to cross my ankles. And now look, this arm is going to thug. I'm going to open up the space. Notice how I'll grab his wrist and now free my hand. Grab both hands on the wrist, and here, armbar. Now, once I start to attack the arm, and I'll use this last technique here. I want to turn in this angle so you guys can see what happens. As I cross my legs here, he's going to switch the defense. He's going to go S-grip. So now, I don't have the same angle. Now, he's a stronger defense here. What I'm going to do is, look, I'm going to bring this hand, hide the elbow. So I'm going to tug the elbow to my waistline and grab it from here. Now I'm going to go like a rear naked choke. Here, all of my body weight is going to break the S grip from here and steal the arm. So once again, this is where we ended up. So we have this position here. Now he has a different defense. So look, I'm going to hide the elbow inside. So I bring the elbow to the waist and hide it here. Now I go rear naked choke position as I turn one and armbar. All right, guys, so there you have it. Some quick and efficient armbar defense techniques that you can use as a counter when your opponent tries to use his opposite arm to block your armbar attack. Hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Leave us a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe. We'll see you in the next video. Take care.